The Pessoa training aid was designed and developed by legendary show jumper Nelson Pessoa. In essence, the Pessoa training aid is a lunging aid that works in harmony with a horse's natural movement. It suggests and persuades to coach the horse to find its own optimum balance and rhythm. The Pessoa training aid should be an integral tool within every horse owner's kit as it helps develop a balanced, rounded horse. Dr. Gail Williams, equine physiotherapist, recommends the use of the Pessoa training aid. When using the Pessoa, normal lunging equipment is required. It's very important that the lunge roller used has a D-ring on the section centrally under the horse. The Pessoa comprises of a number of lines. Section A runs around the horse's quarters under the tail. Line B runs up over the quarters and clips to the D-ring on top of the roller. While C and D run along the flanks of the horse, through the bit, turning back on themselves and clipping to the roller in the appropriate place. I'm now going to show you how to attach and how to adjust these lines to the horse. I would start off by taking the line that goes on the furthest side of the horse just placing the sheepskin tensioner on the top of the horse and that leaves me with the line that attaches to this side of the horse. Now you can see that the young horse is slightly restless by a new experience so we're just going to do everything very quietly, very calmly to make sure that he is safe, your handler is safe and the horse is safe. So what I've done is I have fed this one line through the ring on the side of the roller and the two clips that are on the far end of the Pessoa I've attached for this moment to the bit because I don't want any trailing lines. <clears throat> and if you want to turn the horse around the other way, so, so these are the lines for the other side. We're going to put that Fit that onto the horse in exactly the same way as we did the other side. We're going to slide both the rings, the pulleys through the ring on the one side. And then attach the two clips, both of them at the moment, I'm going to attach to the bit rings. The next part in attaching the Pessoa is there is this V-shaped string with a clip in the middle and that clip attaches to the D-ring at the top of the roller. I find most horses or the horses that are going to get upset about it do get upset because I'm going to drop this tensioner over his back and down behind his stifles. So all I'm going to do is just very gently while either you or the handler reassure him, good boy. So very gently going to ease that keeping an eye on the horse to make sure he's not getting upset or distressed. Good boy. Good boy. Now it's in my experience that if they are going to get upset, they're going to get upset now. So both you and the handler need to be aware and of, of everything around you and any possibilities. So I'm just going to let the tensioner drop. Good boy. And he's quite happy with that so far.
Now the first thing that I'm going to alter is the length of this line that's going up to the roller because I want this tensioner to lie here just behind the stifle so we need to shorten that. Now that there is a very easy way to do this, these clips slide very easily. So we do it to that and we'll do it at the same time at the other side. So at all times making sure that the horse is comfortable and not becoming distressed. Good boy. Now that's sitting in the perfect position now. So we want to now attach these lines in the first instance to the D-ring at the bottom of the roller. Now on the front of these lines there are two clips. There's one at the very end and there's also this clip that's on a roller. And it's the clip that's on the roller that you attach to the bit ring. Okay. We're going to do the same on the other side. I'm just going to make sure that these lines are exactly the same length. Good boy. And then we pass each ring clip through the front legs and attach it to the D-ring on the underside of the roller. The aim of the Pessoa is to make the horse work with his head lower than his withers in this sort of an outline with the head and neck there. And so you fit the tightness of the lines so that as soon as the horse is working in that position, the lines go slack. So the lines are not forcing him to do anything unless he works outside of that outline. When starting the horse with the Pessoa, it's important to gradually introduce it to their work programme, whether it's a young or mature horse. Several sessions limiting the horse to walking will allow him to get used to the feel of the ropes rubbing against him. Excessive and intense use of the Pessoa will only cause discomfort. Only when the horse is relaxed and working freely in trot can canter work be introduced. Commonly, horses that are new to the Pessoa may pull back, swing away or fall in on their circle. This is normal. To correct this, the horse needs to be pushed forward using normal aids. In most instances, it's the right rein that is difficult for the horse to begin with. In anatomical terms, the Pessoa acts as a device that encourages the horse to perform the equivalent of human pilates. The tensioner that runs through the sheepskin section behind the stifles encourages the horse to bring its hind leg underneath him. In turn, this will help move the horse forward in a straight outline. He will drop his back hoof into the print left by the front. Coupled with this straight action, the Pessoa encourages the horse to work in a long, low outline from the pole up the neck, through the back and down to the stifles. The horse stretches and loosens its top line, creating balance. At the same time, the active hind leg encourages the abdominal muscles to tighten, making them stronger and supple. In short, the Pessoa training aid assists the development of the horse's core stability. After gradual practice with the Pessoa, the horse will be ready to canter. The intention of using the Pessoa is to develop a canter transition. The horse doesn't need to canter round and round. The Pessoa persuades the horse to bring the canter transition from behind and work up through the shoulder to achieve a balanced pace. The ropes and pulleys of the Pessoa subtly encourage the horse to work in this way. The canter needs to come from a balanced and active trot. Dr. Gail Williams recommends that every horse owner has a Pessoa training aid and uses it twice a week. Used correctly, the Pessoa will help your horse achieve the balance and precision required to excel in any discipline.